Hey, I'm Dr. Farmer, and I'd like to give you a few instructions with regards to your colon preparation. Remember, this is the most important part of the procedure that you can perform at home, and if you don't do it correctly, then we may have to repeat your procedure. Don't worry about taking any notes. My nurse will give you a handout that has all these instructions included. Please follow them to the best of your ability, and we'll have a great procedure. If you take Coumadin or Plavix, you should be off of those medications for five days prior to your procedure. And if you take Pradaxa, Eliquis, Effiant, Xarelto, or Berlenta, you should stop those three days prior to your procedure. Two days before your prep begins, remember to drink an increased amount of water to stay hydrated. And when you wake up the day before your procedure, you should not eat anything solid until after the exam is complete. The day of your prep, remember to continue to hydrate throughout the day and do not eat anything solid until after your exam is complete. A clear liquid diet includes water, Gatorades or sports drinks, Pedialyte, clear broths, tea, coffee without cream or sugars, sodas such as 7-Up or ginger ale, Kool-Aid, juices without pulp, Jello popsicles and hard candy. During the clear liquid diet, no alcohol is permitted, neither is red, purple, or orange products, including Kool-Aid and sports drinks. Avoid milk and non-dairy creamers, noodles or vegetables in broth or soup, juices with pulp, and anything that you cannot see through. One day before your colonoscopy, begin drinking a clear liquid diet and drink at least eight glasses of water during the day to avoid dehydration. At your first assigned dose time, pour pouch A of the Plenview mixture into a mixing container, add cool drinking water to the 16 ounce line and mix well, then drink all of the liquid in the container. You must drink another 16 ounce glass of water within the next 30 minutes. Resume clear liquids after completing the first half of the prep. Once you've started drinking the prep solution, stay near a toilet, abdominal discomfort is normal, Irritation and hemorrhoidal inflammation may occur and can be treated with over-the-counter remedies such as baby wipes and hydrocortisone creams. You can also use your hemorrhoidal prescriptions, avoid products containing alcohol, and avoid using suppositories. At the second assigned dose time, pour pouch B of Plenview into the mixing container. Again, add cool drinking water to the 16 ounce line on the container and mix well. Then drink all the liquid in the container. You must drink another 16 ounces of water within the next 30 minutes. Nothing by mouth after midnight except regular medications. Remember, you must drink all of the prep solution to ensure that your colon is clean enough for the procedure to be completed. If you follow all of the instructions that we've given you, your stool should no longer be formed and should be a clear or yellow color. Remember, have a driver that can bring you home after you've been sedated for your procedure. This is a total team effort. If you do your part correctly, it makes it much easier for me to do the best job I can to take care of you.